Hello students, welcome to the next series on the GATE 2019 Statistics RGA. In this lecture, we will try to solve some questions related to the limits, such as question number 1 is of the 1 marks, here is a limit question. Question number 2 is of the continuous and of the integration, that's the basic calculus RGA. Both the questions are of the 1 mark. After completing these two questions, we will try to cover some more questions on the MLE estimators, Markov chain, chi-square, least square and uh, convergence in probability all are asked in the GATE 2000. 19. Out of these 55, we will try to discuss the 25 questions, more than 55, 50 percentage, so that you can cover uh, the preparation of the gate 2022 and onwards in a simple manner. So let's discuss this question number 1 is there. How you can solve this question number 1? So remember that since the limit is infinity, what is the meaning of that? This is an infinite series. So whenever there is an infinite series, then you always try to convert this into the integration form. That's a very simple rule for each of the problem. So what you can do is you can simply firstly divide it and divide it both sides by n square. So it will be nothing but my here. This. Now you can integrate this with respect since the limits are changing with respect to the k. So I can write here as a k. Now how you can integrate them? You can simply take k by n is nothing but my say x. Then what is the value of the dk? dk is nothing but my n of dx. So and the limits are there whenever uh, th these are there. So wh now what is the answer is this. Now you can see 1 by n of dk is nothing but the dx. This is upon 1 plus x square. So what is the answer of this. This is nothing but my tan inverse of x. Now since the limit is start from the infinity and whenever is 1. So what is the answer of this tan infinity is nothing but my pi by 2 minus of 1 is my pi by 4. So what is the right answer of this. This is nothing but my pi by 4 is the right answer. So that's the simple task is behind that. Always try to convert the infinite series into the integration form and then you can solve it with the help of this simplified form. Look at the next question are there. Again is of the one minutes, one mark. So you have to think the question complete within a one minutes are there. So that's again a very simple what you can think is that you can simply take sin of x is say my y. Then what is that? This is the cos x. dx is nothing but my dy. So if you substitute the value here, this is fy of dy. What are the limits? When x is 0, what is the value of y is 0? When x is pi, the value of y is again 0. So what is the answer of this? Whenever there is a 0 to 0 limit, it will always be the 0. So what is the right answer of this is my 0 is the correct answer. So you can see that within a 1 plus 1 minutes, you can solve both the questions in a very simple manner. We will see in our next class uh, related to the MLE, Markov chain, chi-square, least square and all are there which is cover more than 25 questions in this lecture series. Till then you can simply follow this link for finding the various videos. Best of luck students. Thank you.